Welcome back to Let's Play UFO. I made myself a big pot of coffee, which is needed. And for the third time now, I'm starting this video because the first two times, fresh, uh, sorry, fraps crashed on me, and the third time um, I got a phone call. So actually, this is the fourth time I'm starting this video. Uh, let's hope it is the final time though, because um, yeah. I just want to play this game for your and my enjoyment. We just uh, built a couple of plasma beams in the previous video. And we gave some new toys to Vladimir. I hope he enjoys them. Um, but we're fresh out of Illyrium, which is a problem. Um, and that needs to be addressed. I also remember that we have some personal armors lying around. And uh, let's be nice for our guys uh, for a change. And give them the illusion of protection. To increase bravery, we have told these people that they are now completely impervious to alien fire. Let's uh, hope uh, <laughs> the myth survives for a bit. Alright, we need Illyrium, so we need these things intact. Let's hope this uh, bugger goes towards you. And if he lands during the night, then he lands during the night. I think we need Illyrium more than we need um, the lives of you fine gentlemen. I think we can wait just a little bit. And get this one during the day. Gamble somewhat. Patrol for a second, please. Here we go. This should at least provide some daylight. It's in the middle of a forest, which is not ideal. But this thing is intact, guys. This is um, a major mission right here. Of the utmost importance. Sir Dies a Lot now knows that... Uh, oh wait, he wasn't wearing personal armor. Alright. The myth is still alive. Holy shit. This, ladies and gentlemen, are mutants. This is gonna be very, very painful. Now it is, thankfully, a small scout, so there's not a lot of these guys, but... Yeah, they will take a couple of hits before they go down. And sometimes they'll take a lot of hits before they go down. This might be a bit problematic, but on the other hand, I do think mutants mainly walk around with heavy plasmas, which means that after this mission we'll bring some ourselves. Just in case we um, encounter these guys more often, which will probably happen right now. I got a real uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle vibe with these personal armors and the headbands you guys are wearing over this. Is is it long hair? Yeah. Sergey. Here you go. Oh! Hmm. I do think these things handle explosives pretty well. No line of fire. Oh! Ah, I call that a line of fire just fine. He uh, took it and lived. Which is a, a very annoying habit these things have. I don't think I can get a shot on him, really, this round. <laughs> Guys, we're gonna need everybody here. And of course there will be one just happily coming out of the UFO and shooting you guys in the face. Meridian will uh, then uh, respond in kind. And so will Scruffy. This is pretty tense. Mutants already. Yeah, well, it is April, I suppose. And even though the game is progressing uh, somewhat alright, uh, I could have had some more breaks with live aliens or money. Or Illyrium. So, um, we are in a bit of trouble. Here he comes, here he comes. Sergei Kelaja Entropy is now officially dead. Oh, oh wow. I do think some people took some hits with um, the personal armors and lived. This guy is pretty much standing on your toes, Meridian. Gosh, you're a bad shot. Our commander's still alive. Pretty good. Oh, 
Oh! Apparently that guy still could react. Eyeball just kicked the bucket. Which means all rocks here. Better hit. Ooh, that was really good shooting. What is your firing accuracy, sir? 49. It's not good on paper, but that was some pretty good shooting. Mutants tend to wander around a lot. Wow, good shooting as well. This probably means that the last guy is in not in the UFO, no. There, there is still a guy in the UFO, I think. Scruffy probably cannot get a shot on this guy, can he? Yeah, there's a whole mountain in the way. Look, the guns are stuck there. Reserve some time units. Let's hope he comes over the hill. Good luck, Scruffy. They might throw an alien grenade even. I shouldn't cluster up my guys like this. Mutants uh, do like their explosions. I think this will be it for this turn, guys. Good luck. Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! It's all right to shoot him, guys. I reserved some time units for you guys. You may fire when ready. Oh, two of them. Interesting. For a small scout, they really cram them in, don't they? I bet this UFO stinks. Good to the face, nice. Yeah, headshot. Excellent. Yeah, this is the problem. No line of fire on that dude. You can't shoot him in the back though. Those were two good hits, uh, ultimate weapon. Very nicely done. Scruffy. Ah, shit. Is in trouble. I suppose I could throw a grenade or something, but I'm not a fan of that. If he doesn't move, we'll have a problem. Yeah, it's a bit annoying. I think we'll just have to um, live and die with the results here. Scruffy was lucky. Now you may make him pay for missing you. Very well done. Mutants are on the scene, guys. They are real. The mutants are real. But so is 50 Illyrium. You can build four of these. Excellent. Just what, uh, just what we need. Thank you. And we need to transfer them to Brazil and down under. There we go. Two over there. And two over there. They have arrived. I love how time flies in this game. It goes for real life and in this game. Alright, everything is now plasma beamed up. We know how the power source works on the UFO. Apparently we don't have enough information yet for... Um, power suits, what do we miss then? Something I missed? Hmm. I got delirium, I got alien alloys. I've got personal armor. And I got the power source. What else do I need? That is weird. Is has this changed in any way?
We can now produce the power source. That's great. Can we also produce power suits? Hmm. I suppose this has changed. Do I need some kind of alien for this now? Oh, that would be so annoying. Guys, let me know. What am I missing here? Why can I not invent my precious power suits already? That is slightly disappointing. Yeah, I, I, I do think I have everything I need. I, I invented everything I usually do. To get my power suits. Hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm really baffled. Because if I have to play this game for a while longer with personal armor, ugh, it's gonna make me cycle through the list of soldiers really quickly. Maybe I need navig- now navigation is what you need for the flying suits. They definitely changed this. That or I just encountered a very annoying bug. I'll keep on talking for a little bit, make this a video, and then I think I'll dive on the internet and see what has changed here. If it has changed or if it's a bug or not. Apparently we only have um, 10 people on board. Uh, rookies up top. Oh, sergeant. Uh, this is the way to go. There we go. Vladimir, kick into gear. Oh, it immediately landed. Which means as soon as this thing takes off, we'll shoot it down again and we'll play it during the day. There we go. I probably should have brought some um, heavy plasma, but let's see if it's mutants again. Most of you guys have armed themselves pretty well. Let's go. It is mutants again. Alright, never next time definitely bring heavy plasma. Oh, no. Wow. Crow Mercury, wow, you are so lucky. You are such a lucky son of a bitch. Nice. I think he lives because he didn't produce the beautiful scream these things usher when they die. Two in one term was a bit too much to ask. We got Peyton Payday Malone the first. It was probably. Oh. I was going to say he doesn't have a line of fire, but he can shoot just in between the landing gear here. Don't uh, pop a tire, please. It's far from intact. Let's just farm the heavy plasmas that we can here. Let's hope a lot of these buggers died in the crash. Alright, this is what we call zerging in mech warrior. Yeah? We just push the throttle, full speed, run to the enemy in numbers, and then just try to out aggro them. Good luck, guys.
Oh wow, there's more map even. Did not expect that. Come on guys, run. I'm not sure if I want a rocket launcher near the ship actually. That might uh, end badly. Hello! No, you kill a mutant when you see it, Meridian. You don't just tap it on the shoulder. I don't think I should move people in the, to this guy's line of sight. Let's just make sure we, we can react. And not shoot each other in the back. Thank you. guys stay put. You will be my designated scouts here. Let's hope you guys can able are able to clean the area. Cockerilla, come on. Oh! That's one hell of a time to find one. Because uh, everybody here is out of time units. Let's just keep an eye on him. And let's hope uh, people do react when uh, this guy steps out. <coughs> Pay them alone, just get to React, shoot! Fire on them! Why are people not shooting? He's just standing there. And Pay them alone got killed from something over here. There you go. That's the guy that killed uh, Pay them alone. No line of fire, that's no biggie. Captain Green does not need lines of fire. There you go. Found him as well. Is it the same one? Yeah. It's alright, you can shoot him in the back. It is the safest way to kill him. At least you hit him once. Now oh, this is a nice firing line. They just don't hit him. Now let's hope he doesn't chuck in a grenade. Come on though! Thank you. You should uh, go around. You can reinforce the firing line because I do think we'll need replacements. <coughs> Book of guns. You had a good run. It ends right now. One mutant over here. Oh, the captain already spotted it. Good. You have a chance here, my good sir, to kill three in one mission. Eh, it's too much to ask. Stun launcher, huh? Interesting. And he's alive. At least he didn't scream. Maybe we hit him in the throat or something funky, but usually it means they're alive. Hmm. This guy really needs to drop right now. One more hit will do. Oh, so close. A 
I'm doing this without control, so there is a line of fire for J-Man. Yes, very nice. Now, I do suppose the rest is in the UFO. Let's hope that guy stayed put. Oh no! Wow. Yeah, he did stay put. Commander. Also, looks to be alive. Oh! Three fatal wounds. Our commander has... Do we even brought the mad kids? Are all the mad kids still in the UFO? <laughs> Shit. Uh. Ah, there's a mad kid over here. Of course, you cannot use this on yourself, can you? Alright, next turn we'll pick it up and we'll help you out. You can live for that long, right? Yeah. Tempted. Could stun him. Could shoot him. Let's not mess around. Oh, you live. Excellent. Okay, there's no need for fussing around with mad kids. We've got two live aliens out of it. Which is a good rating. Uh, which are the live aliens? Is there a navigator? Are we that lucky? Oh, <laughs> we are that lucky. Excellent. Alright, I'll call this a video and I think I'll uh, hop on the internet for a second and see what is up with not getting a power suit in Open XCOM after researching all the prerequisites that I usually do. Let's get the boys back home. And let's get a few more in here. Oh, we need uh, a naming ceremony in the next video, I see. Because we have a lack of soldiers. How many can I order? 25? Let's order 25. Uh, if I don't get any power suits, it's, it, it's definitely what we need. This is pretty sweet money. Oh, uh, I want to keep the heavy plasmas. Oh yeah, let's uh, put them on board right now, otherwise I'll forget later on. LP. Seven heavy plasmas with all the ammo. Uh, let's take seven less ra laser rifles then. Alright gentlemen, I'll call this a video. I'll see you in the next one. And I hope by that time I have figured out why the hell I do not have power suits. I'll see you then. Bye bye.